Oh! Incorporeal sucks! Our boy! Too bad! Our boy Dakor has certainly titled this one. Um, from what I understand, the problem is that, or the main problem, is yeah. that these two uh, basically interact with each other in a really shitty way. Uh, basically, uh, right, spiteful, that obviously spawns whenever combat ends. Incorporeal, uh, incorporeal spawns on a timer during combat. Therefore, because spiteful extends how long combat uh, is, in many cases, likely until the next pull, you just have incorporeal boys forever! Yeah. And then because there's also spiteful boys, it is just many boys! Many, many boys. Boys everywhere. Yeah, and that's the thing. I hit this affix with a vengeance, and I haven't even done a key that has spiteful in it. I've done, I think, one key this week or two, and it was just someone's low key to bring it up. It was like, it was, I can't remember, it was like a nine or something, so I just saw it in court. And we were just sat there going, what the f is this? Bro, what? Because you it takes hard CC. So I was just low IQ in my way, Guardian Druid tanking away because my Feral has gear and my Prot doesn't, so I tank people. Running around going, yeah, this is great, fantastic. Oh, look at that, I'll just incapacitating. That didn't interrupt that, what the f- Oh my god, I have to literally single target hard CC this. Typhoon doesn't stop it. Incap doesn't stop it. Fuck me, I guess. Would Psychic scream? No. 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 So you have to have- Never a, mind. That. Yeah, you have to get a hard CC, which we immediately solved because I'm a druid. I went, okay, well- I, I don't have a solution for this outside of Mighty Bash. Mighty Bash, yeah. And that's a five second stun, which isn't enough on a cooldown. And then I went, there's some bullshit here going on. And then I checked the, like, uh, Dream Grove, the Druid Discord. I literally just search, in incorporeal, enter Guardian channel. Hibernate does it. You know what Hibernate does? Mm. It's a cast that puts beasts and dragonkin to sleep. You know what these fucking things aren't? Beasts or dragonkin. Except oh. they are. They are tagged as I think everything, so every hard CC works. Guess how you would find That's that not out? Communicated Guess by how the you thing. find that out by fing hearing about it. Because it's not communicated in the slightest. So we had a warlock who could uh, fear, because one fear is enough to last the whole time because it doesn't break. So we had a warlock and two druids, and we were just like, for the rest of it, we're like, okay, sweet, we will just hibernate and fear them. That's fine. We it like it's someone said there, it's not hard, it's like it's it's easy to sort, just hard to see. Yeah. Yeah. You think so? Let's get back. Let's get down to the rest of this. Incorporeal violates the cardinal rule of good and plus affix. No f***ing with boss mechanics. These little shitters are a joke. Get it? Yep. They're easy. Until they tag team your ass during a force movement phase or spawn on the mm. other side of the boss room because of ads. Yeah. Here's some... Yeah, I know. I know I can't mitigate while channeling. I know that. But sometimes me dropping to 20% HP is better than that thing going off um mostly our rest of druids hibernating but go around and see yeah da, 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 da. where is it is there some there's some examples here i saw were absolutely ridiculous oh what example oh yes Nathan's slayer first boss had an ad spawn underwater frost traps don't go into the water they sit on top of the water oh, oh <laughs> no yeah. yeah this is the kind of stuff we're talking about Cragmaw. Uh, yeah, also Double you spawn move. during. Oh, of course, opposite ends of the room. Yep. Very fun. Mm -hmm. Very cool. Very fun. Very, very um, good. Old man Emberon. Yeah. Uh, uh, oh, yeah, during the beam. Oh, no, not yeah. during the beam. <laughs> yeah. So if you don't have a ranged one, fuck you, I Mister, guess. Not during the beam. Yeah. Oh, you would have assumed that after quaking, they would have. Yep. Done something like this, you know, gone in there and uh, and, and fix that stuff up. And also, oh yeah, as pointed out, warriors and DKs are fucked. That was one of the thing we had. We had uh, DK in our run, like our guild DK. We're like, hey, what can you do to sort this out? He's like, I can wreck my talent tree to take asphyxiate, maybe. And I'm like, well, that's fucking useless. Sweet, never mind. Never mind. Vortex Pinnacle was doing a twenty-one Vortex Pinnacle on second boss in corporeal spawn during a knock-up. Everyone's in the air. Ruined the key. Everyone's in the air because the point of this fight is the, everyone's in the air at the same time. Uh, what's the cast time? I don't know. A uh, couple seconds. Yeah, because it, yeah, you do. Yeah. Hmm. It's like, so if you knew it was happening, you could have someone hop up earlier, have someone go to the edge tornado and sort it out. But if it just does, you're like, that's yeah, not fun. Sorry. That's an interesting problem. Yeah. It, <laughs> it's, it's horrible. Yeah.
answer. It's not a bad affix, it's just an affix that isn't actually implemented fully correctly. And that's the problem. So, DKs can't grip them, though. 